How about a 39939 going live with your boy H Dub? And I have the honor and privilege to talk to one of the pioneers in hip hop. I respect this man so much for what he continues to do for the culture. He's done everything from writing books, you know, making noodles, cereal, tennis shoes, you know, yeah. uh, philanthropist. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. So I just want to welcome Master P with your boy H Dub. What up, P? What's going on, homie? Hey, man, it's all love, man. I see you back at it, man, as usual. Oh, yeah, you know that. You know, you got me over here, you know, not wanting to walk with the pigeons, but fly with the eagles. Got to fly with the eagles, homie. You know, the pigeons ain't getting nothing but bird seeds. Hey, that's <laughs> it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, and, I, and, you know, by me being a cowboy fan, by me being a cowboy fan, I hate to use the word eagle, but in this sense, it's different. Come on, man. Yeah. Come on, man. It's a blessing. Think about it. It's a blessing to be alive and to be well. And 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 uh, I keep telling people, health is wealth. Don't be afraid to grow and change and and better yourself. Do it for your family. And and that's what I did. And I, I'm just thankful and I'm blessed. And happiness is something that comes inside of you. Uh, you got to make yourself happy. Nobody else can make you happy. Not material things. Not other people. But. Uh, you know, if you if if you if you're a happy person inside, then then you'll be a happy and you'll 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 be able to to make other people happy just by you being happy yourself. Yeah, that's true. And that's another thing I, I, I respect about you because you all about family yeah. and you all about teaching the next one, you yeah. know, to, to, yeah. to keep that generational that generation going, that mindset going, because that's where it starts in the mindset. Yeah. And and, and, and especially you know, for our generation, the mindset is so concrete. It takes a it takes a lot to penetrate through it. Yeah. Well, I you know, the, the, the main thing that you got to look at mm -hmm. uh, as we get older, we got to hold ourselves responsible uh, for helping the next generation and showing them the mistakes we made and the good stuff that, that we've done. So, you know, they won't fall into those same roadblocks and, and don't be afraid to teach. My whole thing is if I educate the next generation, if I educate my family and the people around me, then we all can be successful. Everybody, you know, can get that opportunity. Everybody have 24 hours. And I think when people don't use their 24 hours right, then they they worry about what the next man doing, or, or, or what that one doing. Or, you know, I, I've, I've always been blessed to thank the man up above to to give me enough to where I can help others. So we can't take this with us. This is temporary success. So I just love it, man, that that uh, I'm at the right mindset to be able to educate our our people, even when we lost. So it is it's it's. I mean, that's what my life been about. I've been doing it for the last 20 years, right. giving back and getting into these communities and showing our people that look where I came from. And if you change and grow, then you could get there too. So yeah, it's all education. Yeah, and you and you do it outside of being from where you're from, out of the state, a uh, parish yeah. of Louisiana. Yeah, yeah, so, you know, and it's a blessing, man. Uh, uh, when you when you're doing God's work. The devil can't stop you, man. And so I just think that it's been a blessing. It's been a blessing. Like, uh, and I don't mind showing our culture that if we work hard. So I don't know a lot of people look at where I came from, but I got into product because everybody wants you to, to stay how you was. Everybody want me to be in the music industry, want me to be the biggest person. Everybody in business go up and come down. But for me, uh, the music business, I haven't been in the music business 20 years. I got in the product business. So y'all, noodles. This a yeah. this a this a multi billion dollar business. I got this in in uh, the Dollar Tree now, and that's big. Mm. Our culture, and our people to get this in WalMarts and Seven Elevens and stuff like that. So that's the icon noodles. Then I got the chips. Yeah, the chips everywhere. And then we talk about cereal. You know, we've been eating a lot of cereal. Master that's Crunch, Master Crunch cereal. Uh, we have an own stuff. When you talk about. Shoes, we came a long way, man. That's the Minyatis. Motivating oneself, encourage you actively to think independently. And my mm. thing is, the more we make, the more we give. And that's how we've been able to build economic empowerment in our communities and being able to help other communities like Los Angeles, uh, uh, Memphis, New Orleans. Uh, I could go Louisville. I could go on and on, man. And, and it's just that. You know, when you are blessing, God will keep continue blessing you. So now, nah, man, I can't wait for the tour. 
uh, the No Limit Reunion Tour, y'all, is not going to be a concert. It's going to be a celebration. Mm. So you don't want to miss this. You don't want to miss this because this might be the, one of the last shows with everything's going on. So right. get your tickets now and go out and buy it and, and uh, bring your camouflage. This is going to be a camouflage party. I want to be able to celebrate Mia X, uh, Silk the Shocker, Mystical, Fiend, Mr. Servon, Mercedes, and we got special guest Juvenile. So it's going to be a real New Orleans party. Uh, on the fort, you don't want to miss this. I'm telling you, you don't want. We we gonna turn up. We are gonna oh, turn yeah. up. We are gonna have fun, and it's gonna be a lot of love, and it's gonna it, it, it's it's just gonna be a lot of excitement to be able to see the fans in uh, Columbus, South Carolina, and the, and to be there with y'all, and and after 25 years of doing this, and we still able to get back on the stage as 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 a, as a, as, a, as a family, it, it's just gonna be it's gonna be. It's going to be big, y'all. That's the only thing I could tell you. You don't want to miss it. Yeah, the, yeah, the city is definitely buzzing about it, and we're excited for you guys to be able to take us back to the No Limit days. Yes. You know, like you said, you got your uh, almost your whole roster. With yeah. You. And, and yeah. right there is a blessing because everybody, you know, you had to go to everybody like, look, we getting ready to go on tour. You know, let, let's do it. So everybody yeah. that used to rap, if you know, they still know what they know. Like, yeah. you know, yeah. Each artist wrote their lyrics. You got to know your songs and stuff. Yeah. I've seen plenty of artists on there yeah. that wrote different songs. And it's like, man, they don't even know the words of their own songs. Yeah, nah, it's 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 a, a lot of work, but I love that everybody is a unit. And right. uh, like me and Snoop said the other day, uh, bosses create bosses, and that's what we've been doing, creating bosses, uh, and and being able to have that love in the No Limit camp, the No Limit Army. And to be able to see the fans carry that out in, in his real love right now. I mean, that's special, man, because, you know, people think that, uh, you know, it's about having money. No, man, money came by respect and money came by love. So it's all about, you know, being able to do the right thing and keep growing. So I just think that's what the fans love about us. And that's what we love about our fans. We all growing together. And I think uh, uh, that's what this show is going to be about. You're going to see a lot of love at this show. Yeah. That's facts right there. So y'all make sure you get your tickets. It's going down with the No Limit Reunion Tour Friday, February 4th, live at the Colonial Life Arena. Make sure you keep it plugged in to hop1039fm.com. We let yeah. you know what's good with it. I'm going to be hosting. My girl Nika be hosting. We got the legendary DJ in this area, DJ Prince Ice. So, yeah, we're going to turn the stage up and welcome you guys real big to Columbia, South Carolina. We No Limit Soldiers. Yeah. I can't wait. Make them say, uh, Columbia, <laughs> South Carolina. We coming. Oh, yeah. We, we coming. Ready for you heard me? We coming. So y'all going to get your tickets right now. Right now. And Master P, I appreciate you. I salute, salute you. Homie. Number you love. I see y'all on great the work Because best believe it's not being, you know, unseen. Like people are really paying attention to see how yeah. you do it and try to model themselves off of your hustle on what you doing. Well, I mean, like I said, man, I love my fans. And I just want to tell y'all, in this music business, it's just a lot of snakes in the music business. And you you, you don't realize how much people prey on your downfall till you get to the top. And so you, you got to stay focused, put your trust and faith in God. And anything is possible. And I think that's what's been keeping me on top. And people say, well, Pete, what's your motivation? My motivation is the next generation to be able to give them a blueprint because I wanted to be thousands of masterpieces out there. And uh, you could come from poverty, you could come from nothing, and you still can take your life to the next level. And don't let nobody trick you out your position. Keep going. Uh, uh, I, I just love my fans. I can't wait to see y'all. Yeah. All right. Well, we can't wait to see you, you and the whole fam, man. We appreciate yep. you so much. So y'all yes, make sir. sure you get your tickets. Once again, appreciate you, Master P, for your time. And continue to be blessed, man. We'll see you in the city next week. Yes, sir. Yeah, buddy. <laughs>